Hey, this is Chris with Affiliate Tube, and today I got access to EverZippy. I'm going to take you in there and show you exactly how it works, set up a campaign, and explain a lot of these features to you. Now, under this video will be a link that goes to my website where you can learn about the upsells, the one time offers, the pricing, and even pick up some really cool bonus and video series if you happen to buy EverZippy through my website. Okay, so let's get started. Here we are inside of Ever EverZippy. And you can see here some of the webinars that were already created. So what EverZippy is, is it's an online tool that allows you to set up different types of webinars that you can use. And it's got some really cool features with it. A lot of these I may not get covered in this video, but you will find them on my website. So what I'm going to do is just kind of go over some of the stuff with you. If we come up here and hover over this, it's going to show all of our webinars and the types of webinars. So there's live like webinars, on demand, multiple times, and reoccurring webinars. These are the different kinds of webinars you can create. Now once you create a webinar, it's going to show it here on this dashboard where you got access to edit it, to view it. You can even join the room. So you can log into the room. Uh, let's just go ahead and do one here. And you can join it as if you are one of the members yourself, which is really cool because it allows you to come over here where you can uh, come over here and you can send messages. Uh, there's different emojis you can add. You can add call to actions, handouts, or polls. There's all kinds of stuff that you can do once you get in here. Okay, so other than that, you can also send invites. So if someone's wanting to join, you can click here to send an invite or you can delete the webinar. Registration links are easily accessible just by clicking this link. Um, and actually, if we just click one of these links and copy it and go there, it takes you to a page like this where they can go and get the details about the webinar. Of course, you can change the logo, the title, the timing, the description, and even this form with whatever you want on here. You can see it's very well laid out, very clean and neat. Okay, so back here, you can see the uh, registrants in each webinar as well as the attendees. What I'm gonna do is we're gonna jump in here and create a webinar of our own so you can see how the whole process works. So we're gonna click on create a new webinar and we're just gonna title this uh, let's learn how to play guitar and then in the webinar description we can say learn how to play guitar like a rock star and down here we can put the webinar time zone you can add a webinar picture if you want you can add some tags so if you have a lot of webinars going on uh, you can sort them out by tags to find them and then your video and all you do is click your video and you want to upload it mp4 file so I'm going to go ahead and do that and we're going to let it upload it's going to take it a minute here depending on how long your video is this may take quite a few minutes for it to upload this is just a small five or six minute video I think on playing a guitar that I'm uploading right now okay it's uploaded so now we can go to next step and the next step is where we can choose the type of webinar we want this to be it can be a reoccurring it says you can make your sessions run periodically on specific dates and times multiple times which allows you it says you can host webinar sessions multiple times live like to schedule a single session to occur once or on demand which allows registrants to join an on-demand session instantly and then you can come down here and you can choose how often you want it to play if it's on reoccurring we can choose every day and then we can say a time let's say we want to have it starting at um, okay uh, let's just say six o'clock p.m. and we can add more times so let's say we also want one to start at seven o'clock so we can do that and add that one too so we have a webinar every day that's going to play now at 6 p.m. and 7 p.m. you can select the starting date and this is what is the maximum number of upcoming sessions we should show so you can choose how many days you want this to keep going and playing and then once you have that set I'm just going to go ahead and pick two you want to click save now uh oh I guess I choose the past time um, let's see here let's go every day we'll just do 9 o'clock p.m. here and we'll do 10 o'clock p.m. here and we'll start it on the first okay and then save now says your video is being cooked thanks for your patience now one thing I want to mention that makes this webinar tool ever zippy so cool let's go pause the video 
uh, and you're going to see here in a minute, is that it will automatically send out and remind people about your webinar. So you don't have to create uh, an email series reminding people that the webinar is about ready to start and to join your webinar because it has a series automatically set up that will send out to everyone who's registered to make sure that they come to this webinar when it starts. Okay, so here uh, we have our webinar details. Uh, you can choose your picture here. We didn't do. You can have the chat on or off. Chat preference for attendees is private. You can have it says, Do you want to redirect attendees after the webinar? You can automatically have them redirected somewhere else. It says, Is your webinar paid for your attendees? So you can actually set this up so where they have to pay to watch your webinar. Okay, so we can come over here and we've got webinar type. So we can go back over here and we can change this if we want to. It says, here's our email funnel. So this is what I was talking to you about, um, where you can have EverZippy to automatically email the registrants. So we can turn this, if we want, it says you can turn off all your automatic emails or you can do it individually. So if you leave this on, it's going to automatically send these out. It's going to send one out immediately when they register, 24 hours before the webinar, 12 hours, one hour, and then 15 minutes before the webinar and everything's already set up here but if you want to change them you can actually come up here and you can write the email yourself and add or change whatever you want to next is going to be the webinar registrations so this is the form that shows up for your registration for whenever you send them out for people to register you can add fields here so if you want to collect different types of information you can put that here and then your app integration you can choose different apps to integrate with different lists for your um, for your autoresponder a thank you page if you have a thank you page you can put that here you can get an embed code to paste this on your website and you can also add social media links next is webinar branding so here they have a white label product you can use to add your own logo and color scheme and so uh, this may be part of an upsell for sure uh, to know visit my website because I have all that on the website the different things that are available here may not be available in the original um, the front end offer so make sure you check that out before you buy because I don't want you to think you get all this stuff in here and it may not be included but it might be so just just check that out first you can add a YouTube video link for a registration page uh, webinar branding we've done that webinar tracking you can add uh, tracking codes thank you page for your webinar page you can add codes in all those pages your webinar registrants will show up here it says here are your leads you can see a list of all registrants who signed up for your webinar be creative think out of the box keep them engaged and steal the show or you can bulk uh, upload your own here or add individually and then this is a simulated call to action it says simulate an immediate response from your attendees and make sales pitch through your webinar so this is pretty neat here we can click on add simulated call to action we could put a message a link a call to action button uh, time out the trigger time in minutes or seconds and then choose an image to use for the call to action and then lastly is the simulated chat this is really cool here because you can you can add your own chats into the group and have them to show up whenever you want them to so it looks like that there's really people interacting if there's not which is really cool so there's a lot of stuff that's thought about in this um, online tool called EverZippy that a lot of other webinar tools do not have and what makes it so cool too is that it's a one-off price so you're not going to be paying a monthly recurring fee for some of these really expensive ones out there uh, that allows you to do webinars you're going to get it a lot cheaper price and then there are a couple upsells that come along with it honestly I can't remember right off all of the details in the upsells but like I said they are on my website so click that link under this video go there where you can get all those details about the pricing the one-time offers and be sure you buy through the link on my website where you can also pick up those additional video series and trainings on webinars that's on my website. So that's EverZippy. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you did, uh, leave me a comment below, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and you'll get notified when I do other full detailed reviews of products uh, so you can see what they are before you invest in them.